Well, today's topic on steam culture is tires. Now, if you're like me at your office, you've got all different kinds of tires. In other words, for instance, we have big truck tires, little truck tires, mud truck tires, or as they're known here in Kentucky, tars, mid-size car tires, and midsection tires. So lots of different tires, but one common thread, steam is used in the manufacture of all of them. Stay tuned, I'll tell you the story on steam culture. So to tell you the story of how the tread gets in this tire, I need to tell you the story of vulcanization and how it was discovered. Now, it was discovered by Charles Goodyear in the early 1830s. As he was mixing together rubber and sulfur, he dropped it on a hot stove and to his amazement, it didn't melt. It actually formed a hard mass. So from that concept, he learned how to mass produce tires with use of vulcanization. Now, quick step forward into this process. So we have a tire. Now when they form the tire, they build it all up, but it doesn't have any tread in it, it's bald. And in the industry, that's called a green tire. So here's what happens. They take the green tire over to this large clamshell looking deal, and they're gonna set the green tire in it. Well, what's in that clamshell is a tread mold, which has all these little innies and outies in here to form the kind of tread that's the design of the tire. They shove that thing in there. Now what happens is they also put a rubber bladder in the middle of the tire. When the lid shuts, they're gonna inflate that bladder with 300 degrees steam. It's gonna force the tire, which has now been heated to 300 degrees, into that mold. So that hot, hot, hot rubber's gonna force in there. Of course, you know what happens with hot rubber, right? it's going to harden up and form this tough exterior tread that we now have on this tire. And then of course they're gonna take the, the top off and you have a brand new tire. So that's what I found when I was looking at vulcanization in steam and how tires are made. I went out on the Google and I'll tell you what, after all that looking, I was pretty tired. <laughs> it's a good joke, isn't it? All right, well, that's all the jokes for today. That's all the information for today. Vulcanization, treads, and steam all working together. Well, thanks for joining me this week on Steam Culture. Come find us on social media because we're everywhere. We got great content for you. Have a great weekend.